look at this. So Juan Manuel Marquez was at the Floyd Mayweather fight the other day. He's kind of pondering retirement. He's kind of up in the air, doesn't know what he want to do. Mm -hmm. Do you think Marquez will retire? Maybe not, because maybe the business, how's it going, might be at his favor. Mm -hmm. And me working with him, he's a hard worker, straight, everything, really strict person. He, he like, he's like a 41-year-old, but he trains like a 20-year-old. Mm -hmm. Something you don't really see as a normal per person do. So that's what helps him to this day mm -hmm. improve and get better. But for me, I would love it if he could retire because he really proved what else he has to do. Yeah. And in my opinion, he should have retired when he knocked out Peck. Mm -hmm. Let me ask you this. Has Juan, has Juan Manuel Marquez given you any uh, life lessons? Has he taught you anything? Or has he, you know, taught you about the business side of things? What have you learned from him? Well, for him, uh, I talked to him some, sometimes and he told me, like, you know, if you want something, go get it. Don't let nothing stop you no matter what happens. Everything has been for a purpose. Just have faith. Mm -hmm. um, it's, it's part of your legacy, part of your story. So you, that, that's life. Well, one time on All Access, training for a fight, he drunk his own urine. He didn't recommend that, did he? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Would yeah. you do that? Yeah, actually, I, I did it as well. You tried it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, what was that like, man? Uh, nah, maybe I, I say, man, he does it and it works. Why not? I'll, I'll try anything and that works. Yeah, did it help you? Yeah, actually, I felt better because the vitamins, the, the vitamins, first you clean, people, just, people don't know, you clean your system. Yeah. You do it for two weeks, you drink tea, you drink herbs, you eat right. You, you take yourself, you take good vitamins, yeah. then you do it only once a day when you wake up in the morning. Yeah. Was it hard when you first put your own urine nah. up to your mouth? Nah. And you're like, ah. Uh, nah, you just, you just took it down. Yeah, I just took it down. I mean, come on, I gotta do it. So if he does that, why can't I do it? All right. <laughs> Have you done it since? No, I stopped. <laughs> he quit. I don't All know right. why he quit. I don't know. Cause maybe maybe because it didn't help him in the fight. Yeah. <laughs> But I don't care what you tell you weren't gonna beat Floyd Mayweather, right? Oh no 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 to man to beat Floyd Mayweather. Someone kinda of same like him. Yeah. Same. But Mayweather right now is the best. Really. Probably one of the best in history. Of course he's a major fighter, but the point of boxing is get hit and don't get hit. That's right. what he said what he does. People don't like him for this and that, but at the end of the day he does what he has to do. Right. And he gets everything done. Right. The right way. There you I'll have it. <laughs> All right, Jose, thanks for your time, man. What do you want to say to your fans no, and everybody but, there that's still looking for you, man? What do you want to no, say I'm, to everybody? I'm still here. Don't worry. I'm just a, just a little injured, but I'm going to recover fast and get back in action and give y'all, all my fans, a great, great fight and hope y'all love everything I do. Thank you. There you have it. Jose Garcia, man. 1 0, looking for a second fight, and he's going to keep us updated on his uh, recovery with his hand. Thanks for your time, Jose. Thank you. God bless. Looking